Hi, my name is Tony Roten. I am a gardener and a mentor. And I realized several years ago that gardening and mental health really go hand in hand. And so one thing that I've noticed is when I take care of a plant, I also realize how much it relates to me. And that's the way I'm going to do these videos. They're gonna be unique in the sense of you'll learn how to garden, but at the same time, you'll also learn how to implement tools and techniques into your life to improve your mental health. Care for a bean? Today I wanted to talk to you about how life is like a garden. The very simple, basic garden. You start out with your foundation. You put sticks and you put logs down there to help absorb the moisture that it can provide the nutrients that you need later on in life. And then you put the soil you start covering it with compost and other things like that so that you can prepare to plant. And then you plant those things that you want to harvest. You plant joy. You plant happiness. You plant excitement. You plant love. You plant passion. And you want to avoid the weeds. The weeds, they can get in there and they can just make your life a little more cumbersome. They start to put in these doubts and these negative thoughts, which those are the weeds of our life. We start to doubt ourselves for what we can accomplish or what we have accomplished. And we start to believe some of those negative thoughts and feelings out there from other people. But we realize that we can plant a garden that is so beautiful and we can flourish and you can do that. It's all about your mental health, taking care of yourself, loving yourself, appreciating yourself, finding joy in life. Each and every aspect of your garden, you want to make sure it's what you want. It's not what other people want or say that you want. It's what you want. What is it you want to harvest? What is it you want to dig out of that soil? Or what is it that you want to eat and partake of? That's the things you want to plant and that's the things that you want to harvest. Look at your life right now. Are you harvesting those things that you want? Or are you believing those negative things and the poison and those toxins that people are telling you? Are you telling yourself these toxins? Or are you walking your garden and saying, wow, this is amazing. This is so fantastic. Look at all of this greenery. Look at all of the, the bounteous blessings that I've been blessed with. Are you walking that garden with appreciation and love and excitement and really looking forward to every day when you wake up? If not, I want to challenge you right now to step back, look at your life, look at your garden. How is it doing? And then analyze and then start doing those things that will change it. And those poisons or those toxins come up immediately stop them and say, hey, I am not planting that in my garden. Just plant those things that you want and don't look back. Believe in yourself and believe that you have what it takes.